Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. I'm Jeffrey. Now I've been playing around with LogSeq for the last couple of months, creating different systems and workflows and really just getting a sense of the functionality that the app can do along with uh, some of the community plugins. And I created this random quote resurfacing system with the smart block plugin that allows me to pull a random block that has the uh, quote tag from anywhere in my digital mind so that I can serendipitously review it uh, on my daily note page. So it's just a simple button that automatically populates on my daily note page. When I click it, it will pull a random quote from somewhere in my system and I, then I can click it again and also get a, uh, another one. And then I also have it set up so that I automatically have a block underneath. So if I have some uh, literature note thoughts that I might want to add when I'm reviewing it, it's very easy for me to do so. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can set up and install the smart block plugin, how you can create a template and the smart block and get those to automatically show up on your daily note page in LogSeq. So let's go ahead and take a look. So the first thing that you're going to want to do in order to enable plugins is to go to your settings advanced and you want to turn on this developer mode here then once you've done that you can go to uh, plugins marketplace you can find the smart blocks plugin and just click install you can see i already have it installed here now once you have that done you can go ahead and start creating your smart blocks and templates in order to get it on your daily note page so you can see here that i have two templates set up one for my daily note that has the uh, smart block for the random quote and then I have the template for the random quote itself. So I will set these up again just so you can see step by step how to create them. So first let's start off with creating the random note um, template. So we'll call this random note, uh, random quote, sorry, random quote two and to call a random block, we're going to do random block. And then what you put right here next is going to be the tag or the page name that it's gonna pull a random block from. So you can do this for quotes, literature notes, evergreen notes, any sort of tag that you want to pull. So I'm just gonna do uh, quote. And then in order to turn it into a template, you can right click on the block and select make template. So random quote two, you can either include the parent block uh, or not. I'm not gonna include the parent block. You just click submit. And then you can see it automatically adds these properties to the block of what the template name is and whether or not it includes the, the parent block. So I have that done. And now to create my daily note template, uh, I will do daily note template two. I'll indent. And now to create a smart block, you can see that this is the uh, syntax here, or you can also do backslash smart block and they have uh, a nice guided one here. So you want the template name. So this is gonna be what it's going to call when uh, when you press the button. So I want to do random uh, quote two. You want to do the button title. So this is a testing button, let's say, and I'll get rid of the uh, sibling. So now uh, I also need to turn this into a template. So make a template and we'll just call daily testing don't include the parent block, submit. And then just to make sure that it's different than the other one so that when I'm playing around with it, you can see uh, this is a test. Okay, so now I've set it up. If I come to my journal page and I search for a template and I look for my daily testing, you see, testing button, I can press it pulls in a random quote, and then you can see that this is a test uh, here. So now you can see that I have everything I need set up in order to get it added to my daily note 
page, but going in and typing template and selecting it is not uh, really fun all the time. So how do you get it to automatically appear in each new daily note page? Well, that's fairly simple. All you need to do is go to your settings again, go to edit config file, and then you'll see this default templates here for your journals. You just put in the template name that you have set up uh, here in your template uh, location. And then that way, whenever a new journal page is created, it will automatically populate with that template. So that's how you can create a quote resurfacing system or any other sort of resurfacing system from a random uh, tag that you use in your digital mind uh, using LogSeq and the SmartBlocks plugin. Let me know what you think of this video. If uh, you found anything interesting, learned anything new, uh, and I will see you all next time.